Hi friends, this is Audi One and you're watching part 24 of the Sequely Lab series. Well, it has been a very long time since I recorded a video. Although I had been updating the test bed regularly on GitHub. So let's continue. Well, I'm on the main page of the Sequely Labs, which you can download from GitHub. Now, some pages have been modified. So if you see from the last time, there are two new pages added up. One is specifically dedicated to the SQLe injections, stack-based queries, which is generally anonymous or is analogous to the MS SQL or the Windows SQL Server and is not heard about much in uh, MySQL and PHP combination. So there is a specific page dedicated to this uh, kind of injections. So you get stack based query injections for the string type or the blind based or the post based. So starting from lesson 38 to lesson 53, all these injections are based on the stack queries. We'll continue and we'll go through them one by one uh, in the coming videos. Then the page four, which is the challenge page. On this page, we have from lesson 54 and some lessons will be coming up in near future till lesson 75. These lessons are actually nothing new, but a kind of a challenge or a kind of a practice for all you guys. So just to keep it uh, a bit interesting, what I have done is, that you get, for example, in this lesson 54, 10 attempts to get the secret key out. So the objective of this lesson is to dump the secret key from only random table from the database challenges in less than 10 attempts. For fun with every reset, the challenge spawns random table name, column name, table data, keeping it fresh at all times. So as this is a challenge series and this page is dedicated to the challenges, so there is nothing new as far as uh, the concepts are concerned, but you can just test your knowledge that you have gained by just practicing. So for example, this lesson 55 has 14 attempts. Let me just uh, give a shot to give you an introduction. Let's do lesson 54 and same way, Please input the ID as parameter. So we give ID equals one. So you see on the screen that I have tried one of 10 attempts. So if I just keep on emulating ID equals two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, so it's actually a race against the amount of enumeration you do and how you get out the secret key from the challenge database. And mind it, the table name gets changed every time you reset the challenge or it resets by itself. Same way the column name changes and the data within the tables changes. So now I'm done with my 10 attempts. If I try one more time, the challenge will reset automatically saying that I have exceeded and it resets. Thereby all the efforts that you have done so far go waste. A kind of just an interesting thing that I wanted to add up. This is all for this video. So hopefully you'll, um, I'll be making some more videos and be more active dedicating some more amount of time to make uh, these kind of videos. Uh, please uh, leave your feedback for the encouragement. Thank you very much and have a nice